हेलो एवरी वन दिस इज सुकन्या कन्नूर आई हैव सिक्योर्ड ऑल इंडिया रैंकिंग टू इन दिस इयर्स फ्लाइंस एंड जे आर एफ एग्जामिनेशन आई हैव डन माई यू जी फ्रॉम यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ एग्रीकल्चर साइंसेस दावर ना आई लाइक टू शेयर माई स्ट्रैटेजी विद यू ऑल सो दैट इट मे हेल्प यू ऑल इन अपकमिंग एग्जामिनेशन नो कमिंग टू अवर प्लान्स एंड स्ट्रीम इट कंसिस्ट ऑफ फाइव फाइव इंपॉर्टेंट सब्जेक्ट्स लाइक जेनेटिक्स एंड प्लान ब्रीडिंग पैथोलॉजी सीड साइंस माइक्रोबायोलॉजी एंड प्लान जेनेटिक रिसोर्सेज एंड ऑल्सो सम माइनर टॉपिक्स लाइक प्लान फिजियोलॉजी बायो केमिस्ट्री इकोनॉमिक बॉटनी एक्सेट्रा एंड यू नीड टू रीड अलॉन्ग विद दैट जनरल एग्रीकल्चर एंड ऑल्सो हैज सम ग्लैंस ऑन यू हैव टू हैज सम ग्लैंस ऑन करेंट अफेयर्स ऑल्सो नेक्स्ट कमिंग टू जेनेटिक्स आई विल टेल विच बुक्स आई हैव रेफर्ड फॉर इट एंड वॉट यू हैव टू रीड एंड विच टॉपिक्स यू हैव टू स्किप फ्रॉम दिस बुक्स नो कमिंग टू जेनेटिक्स द मेन इंपॉर्टेंट बुक इज फंडामेंटल्स ऑफ जेनेटिक्स बाय बी डी सिंह इन दैट पार्ट साइटोलॉजी एंड साइटोजेनेटिक्स पार्ट इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट यू हैव टू रीड दैट पार्ट लाइन बाय लाइन एंड कमिंग टू ट्रांसमिशन जेनेटिक्स सो मेनी क्वेश्चन कैन बी आस्ट फ्रॉम दैट यू यू शुड हैव बेसिक्स फ्रॉम फॉर दैट um already have read that in puc and read carefully that chapter and next uh, coming to um, linkage and crossing over probability so many questions will be asked from that and mutation multiple alleles linkage these are the very very importance uh, you need to give for them uh, next for molecular genetics part don't read it from bd singh um i have read it from i have seen many youtube videos or you can make some quick notes from nasrud and seaman's book uh, they are uh, they are given uh, very clear cut information about uh, replication transcription and uh, translation uh, you can read uh, just the genetic material part from bd singh apart from that all this gene action you can read from other books like nasrud uh, or uh, you can follow any youtube channel like uh, shomus biology i have followed that next um, have some quick glance on the regulation of gene action next population genetics hardy weinberg law is very very important you need to solve objectives uh, for that and for um, molecular techniques and recombinant dna technology and genome maps just follow your college notes for that because no much depth questions will be asked from that just have some idea for about molecular techniques like uh, hybridization dna dna hybridization like they are all uh, next for uh, in this book you have to skip evolve uh, evolution and origin of species uh, next uh, genetics of man genetics of differentiation repair of dna you can skip all these topics from very simple book next for objectives you can solve uh, objective of objective genetics bk prasad and bd singh book i didn't solve any objective book uh, i just followed test series whatever problems they gave whatever mcqs they they gave i just uh, revised it them again and again i didn't solve any objective books next for breeding uh, plant breeding uh, principles and methods by bd singh is very very important but you have to be selective in reading bd singh book and apart from that read um, all chapters from funan singh in bd singh you have to read up to um, part 6 that is uh, uh, breeding methods for clonal crops read up to that and be selective also in that and um, don't read uh, stress breeding and uh, polyploidy breeding all from um, bd singh just uh, uh, read them from funan if you have time then read uh, that's no problem but uh, during examination time you know you don't uh, get much time for revising uh, next for um, biotechnology and markers in crop improvement don't read it from bre- breeding and next uh, we come across um, seed part in breeding that is quality seed and release of varieties read that uh, thoroughly because in quality seed they have given authentic information about uh, uh, isolation distance Mm, germination percentage purity percentage is all for everything they have given uh, clear cut data this year also two three datas like that uh, given in examination about germination of types like that 
next have a glance on institutes on crop improvement that is the last chapter and for ipr i will tell it later and in bds in for uh, biomedical techniques you have to read it very carefully and uh, revise it three four times at least because uh, many feel biomedical techniques uh, very tough and they leave, leave it but don't do that just read it two, three four times then you get acquainted with that next uh, problems may arise from qualitative and quantitative genetics and hybridization uh, so many formula we come across from that chapter and uh, heterosis positive and negative heterosis uh, they are also very important and problems will definitely come from that next uh, development of hybrid as well as variety and the proper sequence that follow that is also important and for release which committee which organization is uh, responsible for that that you need to take care of next for ipr don't read from bdc i will tell it later next for uh, plant pathology this uh, this year's um, the trend is uh, the plant pathology questions are coming very 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 tough uh, so uh, for plant pathology i followed angrew for basics as well as diseases part and for diseases um, i have read my college notes also um, has some glance on your college notes also uh, next uh, there is one book called fungi bacteria and viruses by hc dube read it two three times that's enough and uh, about classification of fungi um, there is no much information given in hc dube as well as in angro also old classification is given so classification followed dli's book and uh, while uh, reading the classification apart from uh, dls you need to be very selective because much more information given in dls and for virology part also you can read from dls also and many uh, other college notes also next uh, for objective pathology you need to read Ut <coughs> utpal kumar bhattacharya book also it's a bunch of many mcqs and many many more points to remember uh, parts you need to read them um at least twice next for microbiology introduction to microbiology by tara and kapoor is very important book uh, you need to read first five chapters and last five chapters um, in that also need to be selective and microscopy part sterilization part biogas composting industrial and food microbiology they are very very important but i didn't find the nitrification part composting and biogas part very much clear from taro kapoor taro and kapoor i didn't find very much clear so i have read uh, my college notes for that and uh, you can follow any other notes or college your college notes i am coming to seed science um, there is one book called big pk agarwal principles of seed technology as you know there is not much information is in pk agarwal Uh, so you can read your college notes as well as there is one book called seed science made easy you can read that and for a uh, seed testing purpose there is a one manual called quality seed testing uh, that is from hisar university i have read that so you can follow that um, and also from bd singh i have already said quality seed you have to read from bd singh part next or uh, or uh, you can also follow india minimum seed standard certification on pdf they, they have released you can take um, data like uh, isolation distance for different different crops you can take from that next there is a book called seed tech uh, seed technology by ranganayaki and there will be so many mistakes in the key answers just take care of it and read it carefully next for plant physiology for basics um, just uh, follow your ncert pu book for photosynthesis respiration water relations uh, and transpiration part and apart from that um, read agrimon pdf i have read agrimon pdf uh, um, for that they have explained really very well and you can follow that next for biochemistry i have referred my college notes for biochemistry proteins enzymes ph buffer this is uh, these all keywords are mentioned in syllabus so you need to read only those from your college notes don't read everything because you don't uh, remember everything or while going examination hall and for economic botany 
coming to economic botany many will ignore it but uh, you have to read it for economic botany this one book called economic botany and plant genetic resources by at a glance by amit kumar and some others you can read that book um, there they are given about some fibers vegetable oils fats nuts and uh, fruits um, two three years back some questions were asked on uh, drying oil non drying oil surface fibers so you had to read that book or um, and for uh, floral biology follow your college notes or uh, tna notes i have a for tna notes for that next uh, next section is ipr ipr um don't read it from bd singh uh, for ipr you need to follow any youtube channel for any treaties conventions uh, which are uh, which helped in the harmonization of ipr like uh, paris paris treaty next um uh, trips uh, trips uh, wipo and all uh, burn convention you have to read everything and uh, the most important uh, treaty is on biological diversity that is cbd convention on biological diversity you have to read it must uh, and under that uh, kyoto kyoto protocol montreal protocol cartagena protocol all welcome you have to read them and uh, and uh, apart from that uh, remember the dates years also of that um, when they come into force like that next um, for uh, and also treaties and conventions on plant genetic resources are also very important uh, one the, uh, one treaty is there for example that is the international treaty on plant genetic resources itpj or fa and you need to read that also uh, next coming to general agri for general agri nemra sundar is a must um, uh, just read nemra sundar once and then read whatever given uh, whatever keywords given in your syllabus like uh, in our syllabus um, soils of india is given uh, that's why this year three questions came from soil science and no other questions not much questions comes from other parts so um, uh, read only that part from nimraj and has some glance on all other topics uh, and for current affairs follow any publication that was released current affairs that year and just revise 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 that's it mm. uh, from now i would like to thank agri toppers academy for giving this opportunity to share my strategy with you all and thank you everyone and all the best to all my dear upcoming aspirants thank you